today we'll be talking about when Isaiah Martinez got revenge on Vincenzo Joseph. So in the first period, not much really happened. And in the second and the start of the third period, Joseph and Martinez would just trade escapes. The only difference being that Joseph would end up taking a lot longer to get out as Isaiah Martinez would put out a really good ride on Vincenzo, getting a 1 minute and 20 second ride, which would really set him up for the rest of the match. But yeah, then backstory for this match, uh, Isaiah Martinez, two-time NCAA champion, while Vincenzo Joseph had just upset him in the season prior and won his first NCAA championship while denying Imar the third one. But then in the last 30 seconds of the match is when Vincenzo Joseph, down by point due to the riding time, had to get a takedown. And in that position where everyone thought Vincenzo Joseph was going to score, Imar hit a crazy funk roll, rolling under Vincenzo Joseph. I thought Imar was caught, but he somehow was able to like bridge and move around fast enough to catch Joseph's leg and somehow get out of that dangerous position. And yeah, it was crazy. And then Imar just having great defense for the rest of that match. The key to this match was really just Imar's top riding that set him up with that one riding time point. And then just great defense, keeping good position, taking his own underhooks and then scoring at the very end of the match. Great way to win his fourth Big Ten title as a senior. But it's even crazier that Vincenzo Joseph would end up winning the NCAA title later that year. But yeah, that's all for this video. Comment down below if you think Imar is one of the best to ever not win four titles. And like and subscribe for more content like this. Peace.